anybody anymore on base. GNL died. Uh, everyone convinced me that apparently my opinion matters and I should be sharing it with you. So, doing something weird here where I just dive in at reset and see what I see. Talk about it with y'all. tuned in, volume's good. Either game side, my side, yes, no. Got my Dengeki statty stats on the side compared to things I see here. Got you guys over here to talk and chat. Got the game running right in the middle, smooth as butter. Made it sort of it's kind of trippy how this comes up before the game even loads now. It throws me off like every time. God damn, that's a lot of cap. Adjusting the volume a tiny bit, is that any better? Alright, first things first, I want to check out this guy immediately. Normally I just throw together a multiplier and just grab the body parts, but I kind of want to see what's going on here. Um, ugh. this EX placement fills me with dread because I already know I'm going to be looking at a kind of crappy mag skill and a kind of crappy funnel. Well, that's good. I'm okay with that. Well, for welfare funnel time. That's not a bad thing. These guns in common, long range is great. I mean, I already have an S, so I don't really need to bring these 99, but it's nice for other people. Uh, stats are kind of bad, though. That's fine. Crit, we all know where crit sits. Uh, not, not great there. Okay, that's not the worst shot in the world, but nothing really excited about anymore. Interesting. We're seeing more of these now, I guess. It's actually one of the better ones, because... I don't think this works on Relief. I I can't prove that right now, but I wouldn't think, just based on the wording, this works on Relief. This still helps lazy people, though. A lot of shot defense. Not bad. Interesting. Gonna have to grab this dude and see what that looks like. E plus three seconds of barrage. Um, actually, let me just take uh, let me take the advice right here of a streamer, Mister Supreme Kami. Just bump up that max mic real quick. Also, yo, we got the triple saber. This thing haunts my dreams in GBO. That's really not bad. So, so far the recommends are going to be looking like Saber and Back, but I still got to kind of see what Back's up to. So, I really just want to play with that quick. So, I'm just going to run a quick normal to grab those body parts. That's a down, 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 down. Take 20 years to load. Thank you, I know how events work. Just really quickly load these dudes out with zero effort. That's actually not bad. Kind of mad how nice that looks. Uh, 
Um, I have zero idea why I didn't pull my other stuff. So I'll just... Uh, uh, and I should grab most of the enhanced double zeta. Yeah, there it is. There's the boy. There's the handsome lad. Wearing his big sweater. And... Actually, is that just going to pull the double... Yeah, okay. I should have predicted that. That's me being dumb. <laughs> it's just going to yoink the double zeta shit right off the middle guy. So let's do that again, and let's also hit that first guy again. Just to get the max multi. Oh, hi. Alright, I see you're packing today. Yeah, let's just do this one more time to make sure it pulled everything off now. Much better. Yeah, was that Zaku 3 chest? Wow, that actually looks pretty good. We gotta keep that in mind. No, I just saw Psycho Power on the EX and just made me think of it. Hey, Maxter finally got the chance. Awesome. First things first, since I'm not staying up too late tonight, I just want to grab these body parts so I can uh, run through the two EX skills real quick. So I'm really curious what that barrage is. I'm kind of thinking it might be like Sazabi, but can't promise. Still, three seconds B plus has got to be at least usable, right? Very rarely have they given us a B skill that's just like a complete whiff. Uh, game Hulk, but I don't want to talk about Game Hulk. Oh, the switch. Neat. I guess that lasts long enough that we'll just switch. They give the Cubelia Mark II rifle? That looks so goddamn goofy. Oh, was I really not supposed to? Oh, motherfucker. Uh, d bad words. Don't listen to that. Don't repeat those in public. I didn't realize I wasn't supposed to take damage there. So I'll just have to run it more, one more time, then I can skip ticket to the rest of the body parts. I should know by now, normals always don't take damage, but I, you know, can't brag that I'm smart. Don't ever blame me for that. I like how the Hamahama Saber is just like a rod. Alright, hit that eight more times. Get myself some freebies. Pick those up from the gift box. Check out the alterations while I'm there. I do like be able to hot hot menu right to gift box and um, achievements now. That's actually really nice. I'm still in the habit of going right back to the main page, unfortunately, but when I remember it, it's alright. 
Bam. Okay. Uh, while we're here, let's check these dudes out. We know Maxter's in. Uh, H2 normal is predicted. And finally, Tetra. Thank you. Alright. Um, secret Gundam Arena Tech. And an Alter Flat Damage Boost that is now Alter Tier. <sighs> my disappointment is measurable. My day is ruined. Uh, stats are nothing I'm not expecting for a Welfare Rerun. We never care about stats on those. Shooting crit, yeah, okay. I mean, that's an aesthetically pleasing line, though. I like all the 1912s. <sighs> Man, ever since they did it to Launcher Strike, I knew, I knew this was going to get screwed, too. I mean, C is not unusable. It's certainly better than where it started, but... Man, I was really hoping for at least to be on that. Uh, box standard combo that you can go look at if you'd like in the EX skill showcase I lovingly put together for y'all. Uh, the back, which is a big one because I had the buff up on it. Buff up plus ace. Okay, this is, this is number one pick from Tetra so far. I, I dare say number one pick from the altars, even though I haven't seen the others yet. That is strong. Oh, yeah, and I guess you exist. Hey, Panic Maker. What's good? Yeah, starting to regret putting you guys on 10 second cooldown. That does seem a little excessive. I'll probably change that next time. Uh, yeah, kid. This is what you're bringing me? <laughs> Middle Shooter 35? Alright, that's fine. You do you. Piercing on top of cooldown, not the best, but there you are. I'm sorry that Savior does that shit better. Uh, let's see. Really, another 35. Man, the stats don't really go anywhere either. Stream Slash, getting upgraded from B and minus to B plus. It's a really cool skill, and I'm happy with that. That might be like a guilty pleasure pick. Uh, kind of useless defense. Hello. Aren't you neato? Um, that's not impossible to trigger. Actually, pretty easy. And I see plus power on a pretty efficient, uh, welfare long rifle platform. Uh, Shiki has a new little brother, I guess. I can pull that off pretty easy. And then there's you. Then there's disappointment. God, I really... I mean, it's cool that we can technically, like, 50% SP crit right there. But A, auto, and B, it's crit. And B, subsection C, it's SP crit. Why are you even bothering? <sighs> And then finally, Mr. Boxy Man. Uh, that's not bad, actually. I have fond memories of using Maxter Head specifically to um, test out the effects of Pierce way back when, when Scuba was around. Just to see what kind of uh, bonuses you got, different defense levels. That's really not the worst. Wow, that's actually a pretty decent... Maxter gets boned like every other hyper mode. Yeah, I wanted to see the Q-Blade back, but then you said altars, and I went to altars to make you happy. Everything I do is for you. Specifically. Well, that didn't really do much. And now you got that weirdo split damage on there too, so just bumping a B plus ain't really doing anything. But it's all you guys a slight damage boost too. Man, wow, okay. And then uh that's actually kind of a goofy fun combo. 
like... <sighs> okay, so Titus exists with a much easier condition. But, you know, anti-flinch and also buff up? That could be fun, maybe. So far, we're pretty much looking at solely the Tetraback as the standout, hands down. Uh, nonsense for that. And everything else can just kind of be there. Not really a whole lot of variety and stuff I want to pick up this, this month compared to last month. Yeah, definitely hands down. Um, you're definitely also throwing Harry out of there and putting putting our girl in. LPL Peru, and you cannot tell me her name is anything else. Alright, let's go harass Mika real quick. Or rather, Santa Mika. The Mika of Christmas past. Thoughts and prayers wherever that dude is. I am thankful that he gave me this uh, this gift of a perfect test dummy for all my EX skills. You're getting my expectations up, dude. If, if this doesn't perform it... Sorry, I'm just going to also grab a quick video of that. <laughs> just so I can upload it later to uh, the channel. The EX Skill Showcase channel. Alright, so we got Pew Pews. Oh. Well, you know what? You know what? That's fine. I'll record it later. Good to know that doesn't work. We got Pew Pews and Flinch on each. That's really not the worst. The flinch is kind of nice. Not knockdown, but three in a row is kind of abusive. Okay, that's hot. Oh, you're completely right. Oh, I gotta mess around with that more. I love the little machine gun. Dude, recharge faster, please. I require you again. Stop it. Stop it. Oh, oh shit. Well, I wanted to just see if I could get it on the knockdown too, but we'll have to do that in a second. Come on, do your SP. There you go. So, if I get you on the knockdown, can I follow it up with... Yes. That's nice. I like that. Uh, next question, I guess, which we will do on a repeat fight, because my HP is low, because I ate a cutscene. I just want to see if this thing has armor. Pretty much just bait out his SP shot and see if I can just use the EX through it. Or if it'll just be cancelled. <laughs> hey, you're already ready because you're just B plus three seconds. Yeah, boy, we have armor. We have full armor. Ow. Uh, next thing I guess would be test out range, see if there's any abnormalities, abnormalities with uh, how far this dude can go, and go from there. I'm gonna bait him into doing this in a corner for a second, I'll just circle around him and, and launch from behind. No, it goes pretty far. Goes far, has armor, good damage, three seconds. It's rad as hell. Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot.
Uh, dollars Donuts here. We are definitely looking at the melee for that sick beam boost. Never a bad thing to have. And this back. Probably was going to go on my recommended page. Wow, I actually didn't see the back is, is not terribly statted either compared to literally everything else. That's pretty okay. Yeah, right there. Right there. It's pretty good. I don't, uh... I don't recall you doing anything significant, no, just 2,600, nothing crazy. Same there, big shot defense, but everything else is kind of lackluster. Uh, that's a neat skill, but nothing I'm going to say is required or even useful. So yeah, melee and back, 100%. Uh, let's check out the star attraction while I'm still awake here. See what's going on in S. Bees. Uh, wait, wait, what's going on here? What is this nonsense? So super recent stuff in it, including FAZZ. Not Faz. Um, with frags, lotto tickets, a material. Okay, so it's one of those. It's nothing cra crazy, nothing special. Oh right, I gotta check out the new perma alterations too. As long as we're in here, what's going on with us? What? Is that like a cutscene? 3120 makes me think it is. It's on my head. It's raising my shot. God, I hope they do an EX video this week. I still don't think we got Helios and um, Shia Quanta. But... Uh, a space, that's an absurd amount of melee defense that doesn't really do anything. I guess it stops you from getting punched, but shot attack's great. Uh, torso shooty boost. Honestly, those are so common now, I'm not as excited as I used to be. Uh, big shot, big shots, uh, good armor. Huge melee defense. It would have been kind of silly to be in shot defense. What are you going to do? You can't be b -pex. Uh, Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I'd say preliminary. That's definitely, like, for space, though. That's that's pretty easy to say. I have to think about it for more. Uh, ten second cooldown. I'm really not a fan of the tens. Ever since they came out with 15, I'd much prefer that. 10 just feels real tight to get off a lot of strong skills in a row to really take advantage of that cooldown bump. You gotta, like, dump everything you got right away to take full advantage of it at 10 seconds. Okay, melee. Gigantic melee defense almost makes it viable for melee. Uh, shot attack's fantastic. Almost 4k. What the hell? That's fine. Ace Transformer is a third tag. I mean, there's support, but... It's nothing I'm in love with. Hit beams. Okay. So same as Zeta plus A1. Just a little pew pew in there. Uh, same kind of general stat distribution. Pretty bad shot defense. Pretty bad melee. But everything else is up there. Back beams. A, D. That is very sad. Uh, which means it's probably... Actually, 21-3. It might not be a Jirobi. We might be looking at just like... A good solid chunk like the EXS has. Still, A minus D. Sad days. That's some damn good shot attack, though. Oh, yeah, yeah. Great design, man. Uh, beam on Saber, so a uh, premium version of what we're getting in the welfare. I, that's. That's actually a pretty good melee weapon, too. That's EX, right? Yeah, that's universal. This is actually a really solid melee weapon. Since there's enough ace support out there that you can justify running it for transformer main and getting some work out of it. This this might be a force for the wrong reasons. That's funny. And then the smart gun, which everyone's just going to go nuts over. Uh, pfft, ten and a half base. The stats are there for sure. The melee defense is not a bad thing, because you're not getting punched in the face. Um, universal EX reduction on 
gun. I don't think that happens. I mean, I'm looking at it, it's happening, but I don't know why. That's pretty great, actually. Uh, four spades kind of poops on it, but otherwise, this is a four say easy. This is a nice suit. Um, no income, which is kind of sad because it has that cool income in the head. But eh, I'm not mad. I'll have to see what the uh, actual heading looks like. Uh, and last thing I can think of is the new permanent altars for Victory, which I was really excited to see. Victory has always had a silly high um, melee potential back when it came out, and for a long time after, just being the the biggest D stat total on some of its parts. Not necessarily traits or tags, but let's see what they did with it. Amazing design too. I what one of the best high grades I've ever built, and I would love to build like three more. The magical 19% Vulcans, all right. Uh, it now has great melee and great melee defense and great shot. It's just doing everything. It's got 5k armor. What the hell? 5k armor and mass production through most of this thing. That ain't half bad. Let's see what else we got here. Why you make face? Which I guess you'll tell me in about 10 seconds. I really should change that. Power and Pierce. On 6k armor. With some great melee stat lines. Oof. Whew. That, that is just enhanced double Zeta. In fact, I'd like to go check that real quick to see how sad I need to be. Thankfully, we have Dengeki up here. Actually, Dengeki isn't going to show the altar, so instead I'll just use whiteboard to, uh... Okay, here. 11096... 10353... Oop. Uh, let's... Put a pin in this real quick. Eight thousand armor, yo. Eight like five five five. I want to see exactly how sad I am by checking out my uh, ECZ arms. You can't see it because I currently don't have a face cam, but I am just moving my my eyes back and forth from phone to screen in disbelief because the standard altar is officially power creeped my my precious enhanced double zeta and that is just the worst granted this still has that blade perk right there to at least kind of even it up but oof oof dude big oof Victory is now a very real boy. Um, EX skill is nothing I'd really suggest, unfortunately. It's not great. You can check it out in the uh, in the skill showcase. It's part of the historic four-star section. I mean, hey, good enough... Good enough stat line. The debuff's pretty damn big. You don't need ICD, and it hits multiple times. It just it moves very slow and not very far. Right, so, some pretty fantastic armor with mass P, and some good melee stats, and completely trash traits, we're just skipping that all together. Debuff time up, you're so sad. Yo, 35% on melee, that's pretty great for a back. Like, usually, for, for standard and under, we're relying on welfare stuff, like, um... Archie and, and uh, Bolt and other stuff, you know, some Shinings maybe? Shadow. They just give a flat bonus on the back, but 2035 is pretty good too. Saber. Saber always had the big stats. 
and now it's 11,000. That's pretty big with a good deal of armor. And just a kind of underwhelming trait, but I guess nothing can be perfect. How cute, job boost. And a little bit of a itty bitty baby melee attack. Look at that. It's trying its best. Look at it go. Uh, victory came out pretty okay. Those arms make me very sad. Divider, though. Oof, offense up gamma. <sighs> Perfect upkeep for cooldown. 49% whole squad. That is spicy. Surprisingly terrible offensive stats on the head. Good armor, good defenses, actually. Like, really good defenses, but... Man, is that... Altered max 1300 melee? What is going on? This thing is not a offense bow. But that's actually a really nice stat line. Are we in some kind of armor meta and I missed the memo on it? Because everything these days is just rolling out with a buttload. Like they're trying to make up for, for a past curve or something. That's a really solid stat line with some eh, traits. Provided you have a decent enough shield, you know, when the mag shields, that's alright. Defense and a mag shield boost. Uh, those stats pretty nice. Not shooting, though, oddly enough, but that's good enough. So close. I've actually been passively collecting a few of these because it is leg-based cooldown, hoping that the altar will do something else with it, but EX skill piercing just doesn't affect much of anything. The levels of defense that you need for it to matter, or the levels of offense you need to lack for it to matter, just kills its relevance. <sighs> Again, big armor, big D's. Back, twist buster? Twist buster. Did, did, did twist buster go anywhere? It's still GA830. Hold on a second, you trying to trick me? Trying to trick me. Show me, show me base twist buster. Right meow. Oh wait, it's on the back. I'll forgive you this time. Oh, it used to be A minus. All right, and now it is just solely A. Wow, that's uh. Wow. All right, I see a machine gun. What you got? Reload. Alright, you tried. It's a good amount of melee defense, though. That's neat. Might be useful for someone somewhere. Mad scientist take note. Now the worst EX in the game. Alright, we got some shot attack on here. It's a pretty decent stat shield at that point, I guess. With, uh... Oh god, they didn't fix the cooldown. But still, just a really tragic cooldown. I mean, at least half decent stats. The worst part about this is the EX animation is actually currently borked as well. Like, you fire it and beams don't come out. The other guy just gets pelted with tiny pink dots. It's kind of embarrassing. Um, out of curiosity, what was our divider shield... Stat line prior. Uh, only one mark. <sighs> so you're great, but what? What's going on? Either way, no, no added stats, no shot attack. So that is just a fresh infusion of shot attack. Not the worst, by far. All right, now for what everyone wants to see: the ten weapon monster. I guess this this might tell us that Wing Zero Customs coming next time. 
Maybe. That's a lot of armor. That's an obscene amount of armor. Uh, yeah. Good melee, good melee defense, good equal shot defense. That makes me happy to see. It fires those chemicals in my brain. Wow, that's a torso. Kind of reminds me of Double O Riser. Except there's also shot defense here. Because, I guess, screw Double O Riser. Uh, yeah, I'm not excited. Defense debuffs are unfortunately really, really lacking. Defense is just such a such a neutered stat that it doesn't affect a whole lot of incoming damage reduction, and reducing it isn't going to give you that much extra damage coming in. A meme back boost. The least worst of the part specific boosts. Um. Zero armor still is kind of weird, but I guess someone can make that really work well. What? Oh, that's weird. Oh, it's a 40. Yo, another 40, 25, 40. Only when you have advantage, though. That is just such a weird nebulous condition that I would not like to rely on. Like, if you get a perfect world set up in Arena or something that you can kind of sculpt the conditions for what you're fighting, sure, it's free real estate, it's free damage. But otherwise, weird. Oh, great defenses, though. Holy sh... That is sizable. Full saber attack. Everyone knows it. Everyone loves it. S minus S. I halfway expected to open this in CSS. Nah, that's good. That's never been bad. It's still good. Same kind of big armor, big defense, good melee stat we're seeing on the rest of these. Like 40 weapons. Alright. <laughs> yeah. Back meme. Uh, under 80% armor means you never really get a good chance to use that. Pass. Buff up effect. Alter to your buff up effect. Look at that big fat 30%. Look at that big strong boy. Uh, with big strong boy stats. Yeah, that's, that's a winner. That's a keeper. Those are pretty good duels. If all the melees are going to have this stat line, that's stellar. Like, honestly, that's a fantastic tool. Alright, the only melee weapon I actually have. Three of. ICD and EX Power. That is a winner. Uh, it's a 2035. It's not the fancy new shiny uh, 2540 the kids are playing with, but still. 5% at the end of the world. And the only thing I can really use. That's not bad. If I remember right, it's just like a big horizontal, oh yeah, horizontal, horizontal splash shot. Just like a H3 orbital wave shot. That's not the worst thing. Still great stats for a melee tool. That's 2k extra raw attack just shoved into your build. You can't hate that. I mean, it looks goofy as hell, but someone loves it. <clears throat> Alright, otherwise, let's check out real quick what we got for the picks this week. Uh, try on some big outdated loser and vanilla red frame. Hey, that's got cooldown, that's got strong attacks, that's got an altar. That's something to look into. Yeah, pro tag running off of a melee support gun. Fantastic. Let's see here, they're going to give us our, our monthly allowance of two whole close combat ships. Oh, you spoil us. And I get three standard tickets, that's fine too. And what do you got going on in here? Oh, hey, a couple of nice unique plugins, I'll take those. When I get the currency up, all the usual stage plugins. 
Actually, a couple of these I don't have yet, apparently. That'd be nice to have, just for fooling around with stages. And close combat, good. Ace, I would love some without spending tickets. I'm definitely going to grab that for sure. Uh, otherwise, that seems to be the run of the update. Um, as far as Cubelay goes, the X kill looks amazingly fun. I can't wait to screw around with that. Uh, that melee is useful. As far as the welfare reruns go, everything is kind of at a niche, except for that Tetra back, which is just... Oh, fantastic. And as far as the permanents go, I'm excited about those victory arms. As, as much as I hate my, my investment in EZZ getting creeped, I already have these things up to like EX4 or 5, so I should be able to get some real good stats out of those. <sighs> oh, thanks for hanging out. Hopefully somebody learned something off this, or at least had a new perspective from it. Uh, in that case, I'm probably going to sign myself off and get some sleep for work in the morning. Thank you for coming to GNL Dive, your source for talk on tags, traits, stats, and strats. And I hope you have a wonderful night.